Shalom guys, I hope that you are doing fabulous. Thanks for joining for a just a general reading. So I'm going to use a little decks here for this uh, for this reading. I've already pre-shuffled these, but I do want to shuffle them on camera for you all. And we're going to get a message and whatever the great Elohim of the universe wants to speak about. Yehovah Elohim, mighty great king, our Hamashiach, uh, which is Yeshua. Um, which is a spirit of prophecy is who I am connecting with if you are new if you are returning back welcome back if you are new my channel looks at all kinds of stuff criminal activity in time prophecy all kinds of stuff I feel energy sometimes I can come across goofy if you could just get the gist of what I'm saying because sometimes I know I flub up my words it is what it is it really is energy flow um, so if you just go with it then just go with it um, you will hear information that could be very disturbing at times so you know you'll just want to brace yourself sometimes when I'm having a deep energy flow because I'm right in the middle of the energy itself then you know uh, I I'm I'm known to roar on the camera as well so but anyway I'm glad to have you if you do stay and uh, grow with us otherwise if you've got to go away then I guess you've got to go away thanks for checking me out and all that kind of stuff so I've taken three cards um, from each one of these decks here to get the overall energy of what we're going to talk about so let me just connect here and by the way if it's your birthday happy birthday happy anniversary as well and uh, if you're down and out baby I get it and I just said you live in love. I just ask right now the Holy Spirit would just come and just comfort you and be the lifter of your head. Okay? If there's nothing that you can do about it, then you just need to rest and keep your mind upon the Great One and He will work it out for you if you just give it to Him. Cast your burden upon Him. And uh, when you've done all to do, you just stand there in the truth and Jehovah is mighty to deliver, uh, you know, in, in any situation. So, you know, just cast it upon Him and you do your part. He does the, the, does the rest. So let that encourage you. Uh, um, anyway, Yehovah, I just appreciate you so very much. Thank you for um, coming in here every single time and giving an on-time word. Uh, I revere you and fear you and honor you and respect you. And you are a strong tower. And uh, those who love you, uh, we run into you and we are safe. And I just thank you that you love to rescue people. You are Yasha. You are our rescuer. You are Yeshua, the salvation. And I just appreciate you. Come on in here and prophesy by way of the spirit of prophecy, which is Yeshua. And uh, tell us what we need to know. Uh, we have the church. We have spiritual matters going on. And we do, uh, as I'm recording this for the next couple of days on the Cardinal Fix and Mutable Sign readings, which are down below. If you did miss it, we had the Bible that came out. And we have, we do have spiritual matters. In the fixed Sign reading, we had like sacrificial stuff in the other. So we had like one extreme to the other. We have like the occultic, nasty death type energy of the spirituality and we have um, people that are uh, walking by scripture for life's sake and so whatever this is something about church or spirituality or something like that is here that could be positive or negative even according to scripture we have children here or somebody that you're dealing with that you go to um, to church with or your children goes to church or somebody stumbled up on some information about some spiritual matter that's here somebody also could have a child like brain somebody could work in the uh, daycare at a church as well um, or just something that's very spiritual about you know somewhere where you grew up going to church I can read that energy in so many different directions okay and um, we have the cat okay well the cat in this deck represents somebody who's defensive so somebody with this other energy, uh, the overall energy uh, of the situation that we are going to look at here it has to do with lies. All right. If somebody's coming clean and doing something spiritual, okay, if somebody's trying to keep somebody up in something and th there's some spiritual matter here within this uh, energy, somebody's been defensive, then that's what the cat represents. Okay. So that's the situation here. Let me put this here. What we're going to talk about. Okay. Hopefully you guys can see that. I know that there's a glare. And I apologize. So, let's look and see um, why this is here. You know, give me three cards. Why is this here with the children, the church, and and the defensiveness and the lies and and uh, the cat? What is here? Um, also, you could be Catholic. I've heard uh, the Catholic Church be called the cat before. Okay, maybe you grew up Catholic uh, as a child. Something like that would be here. The letter, uh, the number twelve and the number thirteen appears, and the letter J is also here. Okay, person, place, or thing, first, middle, last name. 
object of some kind. Why is this energy here, Yehovah, for this reading that you are bringing out? Thank you. Okay. We have the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is a spiritual person. Okay. This is somebody who is very... Um, charismatic okay if this is a hothead and somebody's a liar and defensive then in the negative that uh, queen of wands is there okay this also can be somebody's mother somebody's uh you know somebody's um child is here uh with this queen of wands that she would represent a spiritual person i'm also getting another um we're getting a cheetah but we're getting a cat here okay so we got two cats here Okay, some type of cat fight, maybe some type of cat fight. Uh, we also have the devil. Okay, well, we got lies and deceit and being bound uh, within some matters here. Then, you know, why these de deceitful lies and childlike things or children within spiritual matters are here is because there's some type of a lie, lie that has existed here around something. This can be a boss figure as well. We have two people bound in hell, man. Um... Somebody's ticked, maybe because of what happened with children, with the church situation. That's why this defensiveness is here, because somebody lied about some ordeal. There was a hot, hot mess matter here. Some people could have had a, um, you know, a lover, even within uh, some type of an organization that's here. Then, then something's here. The home is here. Okay, well, I'm getting a lot of fire here. And the devil goes to church, too. Okay, we can read it right out of scripture. Um, that's huge. Some, something's over though. This is completion or something happened at a church celebration or if the church represents some type of a marital situation. We, have, we, you know, we got two people that are, I guess, in a karmic relationship here and they're bound to something. The devil can go back to contracts and things like that. What's hidden here, Yehovah, with this energy that we need to know about? What's hidden in the right now moment with all this? So all this exists because of all of this. And what is hidden, Yehovah, that we need to be aware of? You speak it, Yehovah. This can be a divine grace as well. If somebody's getting some type of deliverance from, you know, hellish stuff, then so be it. What's hidden is a lover. This is a lover card. A player is here. Okay? So if you're going to church just with somebody, or somebody's acting like they're all, the, hallelujah, you better, you know, and they're, somebody connect to your home is here, or some, something around church celebration, or something like that. Somebody's a lying predator. Okay? What if that is? What's hidden is this player. This is a lover card. This is the other woman here. Well, that would make you defensive in a very big way. Okay. Now somebody's just like, my God, they're just, you know, something devilish has happened here. And uh, <sighs> nobody likes to be played, man. Just nobody likes to be played. Something very passionate here with all this fire. There's hellfire here, man. Hellfire is here. What else is hidden is somebody stepped out. The four cups is I'm contemplating something or I'm, you know, stuck in a rut. You know, somebody is stuck in a rut. They're tied up by the devil here. They are. Somebody, there's the other woman there as well. Spiritual matters as well. Well, that's interesting. Okay, once to come out, it will come out. So what's hidden is there's another woman here. Okay, why all this defensiveness is here? Because of this other woman. She also represents that. Something devilish is, is, is around somebody's home. Okay, and by God, I guess, you know, if, some, if the church is just no more than just somebody's morals and ethics are off here than they are because somebody's defensive, somebody got childlike brains, or somebody got pregnant within the situation, and now somebody's sitting here in apathy, don't care about nothing, um, some type of in and out energy is here with the lover, folks. What's the advice, Jehovah? The advice is to really, it shows right here, use your intuition. Whether you step out or you're stuck in a rut because you stepped out, it's telling you to depart. Even even right here in the hidden, it's, there's secrets here in the hidden space. It's hidden, but it's not. Somebody's got some type of defensiveness here. Somebody has to know something. Somebody restraining somebody because of that situation that already went down for somebody? I guess so. Show me the, um, well, show me the advice here. You'll, we know the advice. Show me the, show me, just give me some extra energies. Yeah. You know, somebody's wearing a mask, folks. Somebody's, you know, going to get their mask ripped off. The, the, the advice is to tear the freaking mask off. Quit your freaking lying. Quit being a, a defensive, acting like you are some type of whatever you think you are. 
here some lover stupidness and throw the freaking mask off and get into unity the way you're supposed to okay and so we've got you know it's two people here doing something it's more than one person involved in something here with this lie uh, in some type of organization somebody's gonna fry it if the masks don't get torn off somebody's somebody's something out here the um, star this, that was you know this is about exposing things it is showing that well it's huge you'll be just picked in my hands Again, I'm hearing you all say he said it has said it so many times on the channel. You do know what to do. You do know what to do. Especially the Queen of Swords, she would know what to do. Somebody's in the occult here, and they say hallelujah, and they're full of doo doo, and they're a liar. Because we got children in here. Okay, something about a post office box violation around some situation. You know, again, if you're some type of hallelujah a Christian or whoever you are or whatever you are. Uh, and there's secrets around something devilish here, okay? Somebody's in and out playing somebody, and somebody's contemplating all the time, and they're in apathy. Then somebody got a uh, federal offense on them with a post office box violation. Somebody got somebody's um, stuff to their home. Who do you think you are? What do you think you are? You, what we say you are is a lying fool who wears a freaking mask, and you will be exposed, and the whole world is, is going to see what you are, what you do. Okay, so we do have some um, opposing forces here. Well, what's the opposing force? I want to lie. I want to tell the truth. Hmm. Can we lie to you? Because the liar don't want to be lied to either. So it really tells itself what to do. Pull the freaking mask off. There's a heavy drinker energy here. Well, you know, everything in moderation. But I guess, this, you know, this is addictions here with the devil. Okay, uh, guarding your heart because issues flow out of it. Yes, and I guess something's happened. Okay, if you're not dealing with the lover, there's just a hot head stupidness here, and some, somebody got bound up in something. Something about a store. Okay, somebody's boss is here. You work for a store. Something went down in the store. Whatever that is. Uh, I guess we got community here. When the church comes out, somebody's a plumber or something happened in, in the church plumbing. Whatever that would happen, you just never know who you're talking to and why. Um, somebody that uh, works in a fast food is also here. Something like that hidden money has uh, been found and this has come up like three or four times now in the last few days that I have recorded something somebody's a thief can we take can we can we get an offering here so I can hide some money here okay remember guys a couple months ago I had a whole video and you'll have a state of the somebody's putting their hands in the offering plate at some church what my god hallelujah anyway the family is involved in this church matter and it's not good it's it's not because we got a devil here or we got a couple people here we got hotheads we got thieves and liars we got children involved in some stuff we got somebody wearing a mask down here and we got a couple people you know involved in the thing that's tied up here and they're in unity now either they're going to get untied and turn around here and um, forgive something and let let the star energy represent something will heal or you're going to be bound and you'll go to hell you need to depart something here so this family's involved it's not good man yoga says that you need to stay calm because something's happening something's really huge out of this ordeal well there's a disorder and there's going to be a judgment on it yes because this is a disorder people that's that's ridiculous that's ridiculous don't you dare go into those churches and lift your hands up and and then go out and be like a freaking devil and wear a mask uh the military is here well help is here well some people do need help and somebody's been restrained because somebody's a freaking hothead and they went insane for some stuff as righteousness tends to life, so he that pursues evil pursues it to his own death. Well, family's involved, and somebody uh, does not want to, you know, tend to righteousness. I guess somebody will die, and everybody's going to leave it, see this legacy of what they're leaving behind of uh, somebody who wore a mask within some ordeal. What a shame. Something precious has been here, and that's children. And you know, so there's another man involved. So it shows it because another woman's here as well. Um, you know, something precious should be our spirituality where the Holy Spirit can come and lead and guide us in truth and not lies. Um, not playing people. Not, you know, having money come up missing in your in your organization or you're you're just you're just your morals and ethics are just freaking off. Something wrong with that man. Something wrong with that. Somebody real bitter in the negative of that um 
of that uh, card right there. I don't know why I'm grabbing more cards. Somebody got rung and, and, and killed, okay? The, the devil's a murderer. Somebody got their neck rung and it got it removed as well. Now, if you're new, the scripture tells us in the end time prophecy where the Catholic Church and the Protestant churches can be found that we would be finding a whore sitting on the, in the church, which is that old serpent, the devil. So it's right here. The scripture itself is being fulfilled right here in this reading. Okay, We have um, wording that states that people's head would be literally removed and cut off of them. Okay, It is out here. It is out here. You don't like that. I'm sorry. Go read your scripture. It is there. It's been foretold and it's happened because some of us have family members that it actually has happened to. So let the word of the Lord stand true. Okay, If somebody just wants to jump in bed with Jezebel then that's, that's the outcome stuff that comes to you. Okay, we got the beast here. We're sitting right here in the church, man. The king's favor is toward a wise servant, but his wrath is against him that causes shame. Somebody has caused shame out here because somebody got a wringing of the neck. Somebody has had another person. Somebody's involved children within some spiritual matters. They have pursued death. Somebody has needed help. And uh, it's now mil even military is involved in some situation. There's a disorder and a judgment going on. And Jehovah's judging some stuff, right? He says that the judgment starts at my house first. Okay. And so once he gets done with the household, his house, he's going to turn around and it'll go to the whole earth. And, and we already are here. Okay. So people really do need to stay calm because, you know, something's happening here in a very big way. And it is our family that's involved. He said your, your family would be... Um, in war with you right out of your own household okay so they'll steal from you they'll kill from you uh they'll drain you dry they'll they'll you know um they just do all kind of stuff and it's here because people are not guarding their heart because issues are fall uh, are flowing out of it okay so you know people getting into your postal mail and doing some stuff my god that's so ridiculous we have the ps that's here um, the letter S and the P and the B and the J and the T is here in this reading and the J would be here as well. Something about the job and the boss and stuff like that that already came out over here. It's around something. Something happened on travel trip. We had the BP. You couldn't. You don't have to work for the BP, but uh, you know that just says something about a gas station situations. So, some something like that is here. Somebody stepped out, and did something. And uh, I guess for some people, it's real clear. Something's going to be exposed. It ain't good, but it's got the mask is coming off. Some situation. It needs to. You want to be a little demon? Go to hell. That's what you want. There's fraud issues around. Yes, we do know it. Um, this is also a recovery room. Um, something that's hidden that's coming to the light as well. Because somebody's mask is going to be ripped off of their face. And something's going to be known about it. And that's, you know, like day, day and night, I guess. In some situation, let you hope to speak on. Um, so anyway, your offspring is here. Yeah, we got children involved in some stuff. It's really sad. It really, really is sad. Um, but anyway, this is a recovery. If somebody wants to, you know, recover something, then Jehovah's bringing it out here for the uh, suggestion and the outcome of something. But yeah, I guess it's your, um, it's your choice. The, the letter F is also here. Until next time, folks, you look.